now we'll see uh, another problem uh, on diode circuits and this uh, problem is of gate uh, 2003 this problem is also quite similar to the earlier problem and uh, maybe this uh, problem is still simpler than the problem which we have discuss discussed earlier uh, we'll read out the problem the circuit shown in the figure is best described as a bridge rectifier, ring modulator, frequency discriminator and voltage doubler. So we have to identify that what type of circuit is this. Again uh, here this is source uh, which is being applied here and uh, the diode D1, capacitor C1, diode D2 and capacitor C2. And uh, we have to find the voltage across these two terminals this means ends of uh, C1 and C2 and depending upon the voltages at these two ends we have to decide we have to formulate what kind of circuit is this depending upon this output so as usual we will again start uh, uh, with the positive cycle of the input when the positive cycle of the input is applied that means uh, in that case uh, positive cycle D2 will conduct and D1 will be off. When D2 will conduct then this capacitor C2 will charge to a peak of input whatever is the positive peak of the input it will charge to this say it may be say Vm is the peak so it will be charged this capacitor will be charged with this polarity to Vm. Now negative cycle of input is applied for the negative cycle of the input what we observe is uh, D1 will conduct and D2 will be off so now C1 will be charging now the capacitor C1 will be charging with the polarity indicated here this would be minus this would be negative and this would be positive here with this polarity it will uh, get charged and uh, now C1 charges to a peak peak of Vm the peak so if this is also charging to a peak with the polarity being indicated here what we observe here this is charge plus minus this is minus charge so plus minus plus minus they are in series adding so the total voltage across these two terminals would be double of Vm so it will be twice Vm so since the voltage is twice Vm twice peak of the input this circuit is a doubler voltage doubler circuit it's a very simple so uh, doubler circuits uh, have been uh, uh, have been quite uh, important circuits uh, they are being used for um, uh, getting the uh, higher voltages uh, with uh, without using the transformers so that's a great advantage and uh, they find applications in the CRT uh, circuits thank you